Hi everyone, in today's video we are going to learn exactly how to wire a trigger switch step by step for beginner. So let's begin the connection. So when you look here you can see that here is a trigger switch and here is the connection diagram. So when you look here you can see that here is L1. Here you see L12 and L11. Second gun you see L2. Here you see L22 and here you see L21. So here also you see L3. Here you see L32 and L31. So this L1 is the common terminal of first gang. This L2 is the common terminal of second gang. And this L3 is the common terminal of third gang. So now for you to connect this three gang switch, for you to use the three gang switch to control these three different light bulb, you must connect your life wire to L1. Then from L1 you loop to L2 which is the common terminal of number 2. Then from L2, you look to common terminal of number 3, which is L3. Here, you can see here is L1. I'll connect, I'll loop wire from this L1 to L2. Here. I'll loop a wire like this. When we look at our diagram, you can also here is L1 and L2. You can see that I loop my wire from here to L2. Then from L2, I'll loop to L3. You can see you do it like this then from your breaker you take one from your breaker here to to l1 to life wire from your breaker this way you can see our life wire from our breaker to l1 so and now you can see that we have successfully supplied our life wire to all the three commons remember l1 is the common terminal of first gang L2 is the is the common terminal of second gang and L3 is the common terminal of third gang. You can see how I do it also. From L1, I connect my left wire from my breaker to L1. Then from L1, I look to L2. And from L2, I look to L3. So then after that now, then you then connect your bulb to L11. You can see here, your first bulb, you connect it to L11. Your second bulb, you connect it to second gang l21 then your third bulb will connect it to l31 and that's how to do the connection so now let's go ahead and do the connection so so first of all i will connect i will take my left wire from my breaker to l1 of my switch when you look here you can see that here is l1 so i will connect it this way and and remember the loop from L1, I'll loop to L2. So, let me type it. Type it like this. Then from L1, I loop to L2. You can see. From L1 to L2. Then from L2 to L3. As a third gun, you can see it. From L2 to L3. Alright, so let's type it. So, let's type it well. Now we have done with the life wire. Let me explain what we do again. You can see that from our breaker here, we we'll take our life wire from our breaker to L1 of the first gang. L1 is the common terminal of first gang. Remember, it's three gang. One, two, three. So now, L1 is the common terminal of our first gang. L2 is the common terminal of our second gang. You can see L2 here. And L3 is the common terminal of our third, of our third gang. So what I do is, I connect my life wire here. I connect my life wire to L1 of first gang. Then, from L1, I look to L2. Here, then from L2, I look to L3. So now we have done with the common terminal. So what we remain is to connect our bulb. So when you look here, you can see in L from L1, you see L12 and L11. Second gang, you see L22 and L21. Third gang, you see L32 and L31. The same thing here. When you look here, first gang, you see L11 and L12. Second gang, you see L21 and l22 third gun you see l31 and l32 so now we are going to connect our bulb to 
First gang will connect our bulb to L11. Second gang will connect our second bulb to L21. And third gang will connect our bulb to L31. So let's go ahead and connect it. So when you look here, you can see that here is L1 of the first gang. So let's do this. You can see here is my first bulb. I'll connect it here. So my first bulb is connected. So now let's connect our second bulb. So here is my second bulb. I'll connect it to L21 of the second guy. You can see that here is L21. So let's do it and connect it. So connect it to L21. This way. Then let's connect our third bulb to L31. When you look here, you can see that here is L31. So we connect the board there. So connect our board to L31. And now we are done. So now what remains is our motor. Mm. So now you can see that here is our train motor. We are going to connect all our motors together. So, so from this third bulb, I'll, from this third bulb, I'll connect it this way. All of them, we connect together this way. Your neutral goes together. So now we are done with the connection. So let's go ahead and test. So let me on my breaker, so you can see, this one turns on, the second one on, and the third one on. So this is how to do the connection, it's very simple. So you can see, now you can use the, three, the switch to control the third black ball. you can see it. So in case, if you need this diagram, if you need this diagram, don't drop it in the comment section and I'll send this diagram for you.